Hello everyone, it's Nappy Couple here, and today we have a special video. Ooh, what's it about? Your birthday is coming up very soon. Mm -hmm. What's the day today? Today is the 3rd of, of August. August. And August 4th is Nadia's birthday. In order to celebrate that, today we're making a cake. Mm -hmm. Strawberry one. And now the twist is, because it's her birthday, she was going to bake the cake, but no, I'm baking it. <laughs> so I'm going to have my first attempt today at baking a cake. What? Which is why the video is titled, Husband tries making his wife a cake for the first time in his life. <laughs> No, I did not expect that one. That's something I had no idea about. Yeah, let's see how that goes because this guy has never baked in his entire life. <laughs> so pray for the best results. What you need to do first is turn on the oven. And because Nadia had no idea actually yeah, that that's right. I'm going to be baking today. Yeah. She already baked this ahead of time, which is mm -hmm. the first layer for the cake. But that doesn't mean I'm cheating because I have to make <laughs> a second layer right now. Now take out six eggs. That's a lot of eggs. Mm -hmm. I need you to put the whites here and the yellows there. This oh is harder God. than winning a game of League of Legends. <laughs> Tell you what, th this stuff does not feel nice in the hands. <laughs> of course not. Third one. Fifth one. <laughs> oh! Ow! <laughs> that was not a nice <laughs> job. <laughs> he clawed my back <laughs> to that fall. Here it comes. For someone that has never cooked or baked much in his life, he's doing actually very good. Thumbs up. That's six egg whites and six egg yolks. Ooh, good job. Chukar. Chukar. <laughs> good enough. Chukar mochka. Yo. Polo hruba mocha. Mm -hmm. Three of these big spoons. One. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit faster than that. Two. Mm -hmm. Put it the fastest. There you go. <laughs> this thing's gonna fly out somewhere. You need to wait and let it fluff up. Oh, that's fluffing real good. Crank that to a four. Oh, yeah. Open it up and put it above your head. That's how you check for the perfect consistency. If it's going to fall on your head, red baby boy, you did not do it enough. <laughs> well. Ooh, oh yeah. Very good. You did a very good job indeed. <laughs> the consistency is French. We have a new place finally in our kitchen, a bar that we can sit at and drink at. As you can see, Mr. Peckholms is already a fan of the bar. Indeed. <laughs> if we continue to make more eating content, this is where we will be eating now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I'm going to fold this in like a baby's bottom. Well, not that gently, okay? But it's a baby. Baking is actually something I've done pretty much my whole life. Like, as long as I remember, I've always been baking in this family, so. That's right. Yeah, I was going to actually make this cake myself, but he suddenly, as you saw guys, jumped in that he's going to do it. So. so that's the thing. This is actually the first time I can bake her a cake. Yeah. Because up till now, we haven't actually lived together mm -hmm. or even been together for that matter on your birthday. Yeah. So we've known each other for how long? Almost seven years. And this is the first time that we're together on her birthday. Yeah, that's crazy. The struggles of long distance relationships. True. It looks pretty well mixed to me now.
Mm -hmm. Now, there you go. Good job. So here's some of the ingredients for you. This is vanilla kovi sugar. So vanilla sugar. Indeed. Maslo, mm -hmm. meaning butter. Very good. And mleko, meaning milk. Very or is it mleko? Mleko. Mleko. 250 ml. That's a lot of milk. In the pot, the mleko. Yo. Some powdered sugar. Oh, he's found it. Hey, hey, hey. Cats are so... <laughs> Not. Yo, you can't even tell we have a second kid. Like, <laughs> it's literally just this <laughs> guy. <laughs> like, look at him. That kitten is being a good kitten. <laughs> look at that. Munchi likes to sleep. Peckums no. likes to be around us. <laughs> Can we put the whole thing in there? Of course. What a sweet thing. This is like highway to diabetes. <laughs> getting real steamy in there. It's like some alchemy. We put our pudding on hold, because yeah. first we need to get this thing out of the oven. So while it's off the heat, I'm gonna add some butter. This guy needs a cool down. Mm -hmm. Bye. Hello. We're back. It's been a while. Two oh. hours, but it's okay. We are, sir, going to check out a gem. I don't know what kind of gem. I'm hoping it's a strawberry gem. Yahudi. Mm hmm. It's homemade. And as you see, us chicks, we like to reuse bottles like this. So this obviously isn't what's in it. It's some sort of gems. And I'm hoping it's strawberry gems that we could use. <laughs> it's a. Uh, Surprise! <laughs> I'll do the smell, you do the taste. <laughs> oh, there you are! It's probably going to be hard to open, so we will need this. But first, try to open it. <laughs> You're quite struggling. <laughs> hey, let me help you. It's impossible. You need a spoon or something. I'm going to use this countertop. I don't know if you heard that. It just inhaled a bunch of air, and now it should be able to go. Magic. <laughs> Once the air's out, it plops right up. Hmm. I'm not sure if that's strawberry. That smells like mm. old medicine. Wanna try it? You're not gonna like it, it has seeds. Mm-hmm. Not strawberry, okay. Time to move on. Try number two. I hope this is strawberry. <laughs> I don't know if it is. This one has a much lighter scent, but I think it's probably the same one from before. Like it could be strawberry, but I think it smells more like the previous. Tasty, not a strawberry. That's right. Didn't smell like a strawberry. That's that good. No jam. We have enough sugar. Ain't no sugar. We have enough sugar in like, the cake for it to be already sweet. Right? And use that. It's gonna be better like that, right? It tastes basically like a strawberry jam without a strawberry flavor in the end. Yeah. But I think I think it's a good substitute. Yay! <laughs> Here is our pudding from earlier. Mm -hmm. And it still needs a lot more time. Yeah. But what we're gonna do now is fluff it up a bit more and then put it back into the fridge. So yeah. now it's been whisked and it's looking much more proper, like a cream straight out of some baking documentary. In order to see if it mixed well, I am going to try some of it now. That's a tasty cream. Very tasty. Now it's time for the master chef's approval. Oh yeah, I say now it's perfectly mixed. Now that's all for the cut ones. Now we're gonna have uncut ones. Indeed, these are going to go on top as the top as decorations. Mm. 
Oh yeah. I say, based on this smooth, even surface with the little belly button here, this one's mine. That's right. That's how I designed it. Now make sure you put it in the middle and though try not to miss it, like go up or down. I can already see your knife going too low. Should I do it? I'll use my wife's chance for this because <laughs> shape is important and this kind of stuff I suck at. Now let's see how did I do. Poorly or good enough? Oh yeah, that looks good enough to me. Now I'm going to start out by coating this layer with some jam. Now that's done for jam. Here we go, cream on top of the jam. Create a lovely mesh of flavors. And to be honest, this cream is so flavorful that... <laughs> Nandi is giving me a look like she's not happy with it. Maybe <laughs> she doesn't like how the white infused with the jam. But no one's gonna open up their cake like this and... You can literally see it when you cut into it. Every single layer, man. You could have seen how there's a nice layer jam and then there's a cream on top and it's nicely separated. But this guy will know. I'm gonna mix it. Oh, well, it's a nice flavor now. <laughs> now we have a beautiful thin layer of jam this time around with another beautiful thin layer of cream to follow. So here comes the strawberry bay. <laughs> I had my moment with strawberry bay, now it's time to be more focused. Let's get the jamming up in here. Time to jam up in the party, yeah. It's a birthday party, everyone get out your jam. Time to jam it in the party, yeah. And now I'm going to put these strawberries on the outer edge. Yeah, man. Oh, yeah. That's a beautiful cake. Wow. Now that's a strawberry I'm impressed, cake. boy. That's a really pretty <laughs> cake, though. So there you have it, guys. This is my first ever cake I made. Tomorrow, when we eat this, we will see you guys again. So now we're gonna go and eat some of that cake with Nadia's family. Mm -hmm. We've had a lunch outing with them. Yeah. But they don't want to be on camera because they're comfy right now. So yeah. we'll just record ourselves eating it. Let's go. Mm. Look at that. Looks really pretty. That's a really good cake. I like it. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Yum. Mm. Mm. My first time eating a self-made baking. Mm. Indeed. <laughs> I would think. This is sorbet cake. That was a good. Really? Recipe. But I like it more than sorbet cakes. That's a good job then. I was worried yesterday that there wasn't enough cream in between the layers because it was quite, you know, there wasn't much of it. But thanks to the jam, it's perfectly moist, sweet, and it's really good. I'm surprised. Now I know that <laughs> there doesn't have to be like this much cream. This is just fine too. On a finished plate. Mm -hmm. I'm so full. <laughs> We're supposed to have a birthday pizza dinner. Yeah, I don't think that's happening no one, anymore. No one's available for that because we're all very full. Mm -hmm. We had a late lunch as well. Yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, then let us know what is your favorite cake. Yeah. And hopefully... See you next time.